So the story started long before I had any idea what God was doing. But when I came into the picture, it was August 2012, and I was barreling horseback to the backwoods of Tennessee. And this feeling came over me that I had never experienced before. To the core, everything felt right. So when I got back home and I typed in Christian Horse Ministry, I found a lot of ranches that were specifically targeting at-risk youth for abused and neglected foster kids. And a lot of them were linked back to a ranch in Bend, Oregon called Crystal Peaks Youth Ranch. They taught these ranches how to do what they were doing. And what they do is take abused and neglected horses that they have trained and rehabilitated and pair them with abused and neglected children. And the two get to heal together. We got to visit some of these ranches and just confirm that this is what I was made to do. This is where my soul flourishes. And so we prayed, Lord, you've asked us to sell our house. Where do you want us to go? One Sunday after church, my husband had come to me and he said, Roxy, I feel like the Lord said this is for your healing. And wouldn't it be just like him to send you back? And when he said it, I knew it was true. That was the last place I wanted to be. That's where my abuse had taken place. Lord, this is where it all started. And he said, you're right, it is. And he flashed a picture over my mind of me riding my first horse. And I just lost it. I wept. and. He said, I knew you and I saw you and I have planned this. That moment when you're seen by God, we're told it and you believe it, but when it comes from here to your heart, there aren't words. The Lord had this planned long before I even had a clue. That little girl dream of pairing an orphanage with an animal shelter, he put that there. But I had to come back home, back to face what I had ran from. It has been a journey, but it is the most amazing thing and gift that God has given me. This was the day that he had given me the purpose that I'd asked for since I was 19. Lord, what is my purpose? What is the plan? Ephesians 2.10 For you are God's handiwork created in Christ Jesus for good works that he prepared beforehand. And so here at this property, we know that we know that this ground is his. It is sacred. It's being redeemed. And so that became our name. We're Redemption Youth Ranch. God rescues, He restores, and then He redeems. He sends you out with a purpose for His kingdom. So this is where you and I come in. This is not just my story. This is God's story. You and I get to link hands and fight for these kids, to share with them the love of Christ, to show them the love of Christ. Redemption Youth Ranch exists to be an environment that allows kids to feel safe, supported, loved, and have fun. It's in that environment that the Holy Spirit can do its work and a kid can heal. RYR is a place where kids can come that have gone through emotional or physical trauma or they've even gone through abuse or have been neglected. And here they can be paired with a mentor to find confidence in stuff like riding horses, archery, fishing, and anything else they want to do. We provide a safe place for at-risk kids and we come in and mentor them one-on-one. -on -one. Some things that RYR does is they get closer to kids who just need somebody to talk to. Redemption Youth Ranch is all about having fun and hanging out. Well, each week when James comes out here to the ranch, it's another place where he gets loved and he feels valued. Uh, we see his confidence grow. 
We see him having opportunities to grow physically and cognitively and emotionally and spiritually. And when he leaves, he comes home with lots of excitement about uh, wanting to tell us what he's done and what he's learned. The mentoring has been awesome because he can just connect with Chad in a way that is just so spiritually uplifting for him. It's really great to just get outside and just enjoy the fresh air, enjoy God's creation, and just enjoy the horses here. It's kind of like a sanctuary to me. I like to just hang out, ride the horses, and we have a choice of doing like archery, or you can even paint on the horses, that's really fun. Coming here has really helped him to build relationships in a positive way and be able to work around or work through those negative relationships that he was having. We do life with these kids. We try to let them have some fun. So when a kid comes up to me and they, you know, burst out of their car and they just run up to me and give me a huge hug, it, it just warms my heart because it, I, I've seen the change in that child. So I'm so excited to be a part of what the Lord is doing here. He's rescuing these kids. He's restoring them. He's redeeming them. 